Hello and welcome back everyone to part two of myself playing in Pizoila Tour in society mode. So you've got the experience of the crowds. I am now on the back nine. This is another part five, split, f oh god that fly. This is another split fairway. Fairly long par 5, 569, and you will notice water feature here. Ta -da. Anyway, now depending on what T you actually get away, um, what T you're actually um, starting from if you're on the front tee you can actually make it with the yeah you can actually make it to here and with the good wind behind you okay let's go for this let's see if we can do this Fast and perfect. Now that should bring me, or give me enough legs to get there. Yes, it does. It now has to stop. Again, this was tweaked from the original uh, Sophia Heights, <coughs> which is basically based on. And that should. Okay, let's see if I can make this in make the green into not like that it won't I'd be lucky to get away with this oh. well it's better than landing in the bunker okay let's see where we'll end up yep yeah, there's a little bit of movement so nope too much to the right, and I'm going to end up further than I anticipated. This breaks from right to left, so I need to give this. That's not enough. Okay. Still staying in one under, that's not too bad. And this one, my 11th hole. This is actually a dog leg, dog leg right. And with a little water for feature. Now I do give you the, there you go. That's the waterfall. Looking at this, there's a lot more I could have done with this just to enhance it, but there you go. Now there is the opportunity to actually hit it over, hit it between these two trees, and it is doable. You can do it with a driver. I think from the original one, I removed a tree from here as well. Right, let's see if we can do this. Concentrate. Mm. Oh, that's all I needed. Damn it. What a total crappy shot. Yards that should no, nope. they didn't have enough legs. Okay, I promise I'm going to lose that. Uh, what am I 
doing this for? I can pitch this. Ooh, too much. Far too much. I'm definitely going to lose. Them. And again, I'm going to end up between bunkers. And this is exactly why I put this bunker there. And why number four pin is so difficult. Especially if you end up like I did. I am going to get really bad with this one. Damn it. Oh god. Let's give this one more go. Again. I think I may be... strokes, 10 strokes to do that. Okay, let's see what we do. What am I doing? Plus four. Blinking heck. What the hell's going on? Nine strokes. Right, this is a ch opportunity for me to get back some of those lost strokes. Again, that's a rubbish hit. As you can see, there's more planting in this one as well, with more rocks. Put rocks in the foreground as well. Foreground and background. That fly is going to die soon. Sorry guys, I don't know if you, can, if you notice, there sort of seems to be humming, buzzing around my head. <laughs> right, this is where I completely go to pot now. Completely, completely, see? And if you do ask, yes, I do use a lot of um, multi-planting for the rocks and the grass. Right, number 13. On the left-hand side, you can see a waste bunker. For those of you who don't know, that's the one here with that around it. That uh, mulch, or yeah, the mulch around it. So, this is a part four. It should be a relatively easy one, but again, it's elevated. Oh, God. Look at that go. That fly is going to die. Those of you wondering, I'm playing this a Sunday morning. This is Sunday morning. What time is it? It is just gone 9:09. So most people are in bed, tucked away, still sleeping. I'm downstairs watching YouTube videos and also uh, playing games. Living the life. Opportunity for me to get a birdie. I play this right. Go, go, yes! For a minute then. 
I thought I had missed that. Okay, 14 and 14. Again, this is another hole that I tweaked. I changed this up slightly. And you'll notice here, I started um, basically technique for doing like sand dunes and everything. This is where it started to originate from. Uh, I just experimented with it and stuff. If you played my Rebellion tour, you will notice that I used a lot of uh, sand dune techniques, if you want to call it that, in that one. Again, elevation here is quite high. If I remember correctly, That was just my phone going off. So just bear with me one second, guys. I just need to see. 